this is ridiculous. Ending game with zero kills in Russian powerful tier 10 artillery. I do not know what is going on. I've tried my best. I do not know what is happening. Oh no. Oh. Hello? Oh. I'm sorry, Yuri. Yuri, I... It... I tried my best. Yes, I know. I'm playing glorious, powerful Russian tank. And... Yes. What can I do? What can I do? I need to get at least one kill. RNG? Will be... You have a... <laughs> okay, that's good, good. Alright, we'll move forward here. Yes, Yuri. Uh, but won't I get detected in Russian uh, SPG? Uh, there is... Oh, I'm... Uh, Yuri, I'm detected. What do I do? What do I... Don't worry. How can I fight these powerful tanks? There is powerful American T-30, Fosh B. Oh, there is T-30. Yuri, it is over. No. Drive straight toward him, okay? Yes, okay. Uh, Yuri, I missed shot. I thought you were going to fix RNG. Just drive toward him, everything work out? Okay, yes, we, we go. Uh, we're going, Yuri. Then what do we do? What if other tank shoots us? It will bounce? You have fixed RNG? Oh, okay. <laughs> yes, it bounced. Well, I, I'm on reload. Just hit. Everything will work out? Okay. We hit straight for him, Yuri. Okay, I'm not sure what is going to happen here. Uh, uh, oh, da, da, it's good, yeah. Oh, we squish uh, American powerful TD like bug. Good. Ah, Soviet tank emerges victorious with one kill. Thank you, Yuri. I know, I know. Next time I try harder. Uh, my job is never done. Hey guys, how you doing? Welcome back. Hope you're having an absolutely fantastic day. The question for you today is, how do you achieve a result like this? Absolutely incredible. Any idea how that is possible? Religion of Rage is in his little AMX ELC. This. In a tier 5 game. Tier 5, tier 4. He's not fighting bots. Okay, that's what you probably were guessing. I ah, thought there was 12 bots. No, there were not 12 bots. This is absolutely insane and incredible. Another in the series of how is this possible. Check out the whole playlist. The games in this playlist are just insane. They're insane from inside. And this guy does not have, when I play the ELC best, I prefer the smaller gun that has a turret so that I can uh, sh shoot faster. It's faster reload. It's lower alpha, shoots faster. Um, but you can turn your turret. Whereas this gun only enables you a small gun arc and we, don't, we are not seeing the uh, enemy... Uh, the enemy outlines because Wargaming doesn't want me to make good videos anymore. Uh, so there's a, a glitch and I just fixed it. <laughs> and he took a blind shot, that might have hit. This gun is much harder to uh, manage because you, you're turretless. You, you have to point at the enemy. So a lot of the times if you're running away or if you're poking around a rock or around a building, you can't just back out, turn your turret, shoot and scoot out of the way. You have to be pointed at them, like a grillet. Then you shoot. And you have to, like, back up and get out of the way. So it's more awkward. But he did not get spotted. It also has much poorer gun handling than the other gun. But this guy's chosen to use it. It has higher alpha. He's chosen to use it. He's got three marks on his barrel. He knows what he's doing. And he's just gonna be an annoying little he got him on the move and scoots out of the way he... oh, no, 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 no. don't get hit by the t28 he's making himself just a little pain in the ass he's got some spotting assist here guys who is he gonna shoot who are you gonna shoot who are you gonna call who are you gonna call shoot shoot the, the guy that's up no he's gonna shoot this guy yes shoot that guy and scoot under scoot it to the low ground 
There's a, an enemy, look at the minimap. There's a guy over here that can snipe him. But he's been very sneaky. Every time he shoots, he scoops. It's a shoot and scoop. Shoot and scoop. But he's not camping, uh, uh, you know, in a bush at the back. He's not passive spotting. And uh, the tendency with this thing, when you're playing with this gun, is to camp in a bush and play as a TD. Because it behaves like a TD. But this guy is like a little cockroach TD. Like, he's... You know, scooting around, using his concealment to get in positions like this, and boom! He shoots, and he scoots. We're going to call this video Shoot and Scoot. Now we have to call the video How. How is this possible? Is this crazy? Uh, and they're losing 2-6, guys. They're losing 2-6. So this is, it's going to get, like, insane here. Oh, they're, they're, Wargaming put a dead tank in your way. Okay, now can you do it? Can you do it? Aim. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. oh a map aware, situational awareness there, but it got in the way of you aiming your shot. Situational awareness. Boom. Fully aimed. 238 damage. Shoots and scoots. He's a shoot and scooter. Is he going for the retreat? Yes, he is. Because if you look at the minimap, this guy has fantastic map awareness. Look. They've lost this, right? There's one, two, three, four, there's probably four or five enemies here that are going to push forward, and he can't be caught. He can't be caught in the open. You know, a, a, a detected cockroach is a dead cockroach. So he's moved into this spot. And is he going to shoot that down? Yes. That He, he loaded an HE shell to shoot down the house. So now, because he, know, he knows the maps. This guy is brilliant. He knows what he's doing. Is he going to shoot down the house again? No. I think he wanted to. He probably needed two HE shells. Oh, there's a PZ. Four. He sees him. Whoop. Yes, get ready. Yes, 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 yes. Two nine. Oh, it's... They're just losing. It's a blowout. It's another Wargaming blowout. Good job, Wargaming. Good matchmaking. Another blowout. But they didn't take into consideration Mr. Shoot and Scoot. Let's just watch here, guys. Just, just be, just be patient. Aim, 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 aim. Oh, stop! Boom. Got. Oni Zau, and the score is three ten. Okay. Just, just enjoy the gameplay now. He aims. He has to aim. Oh. He's got the losing team RNG going on now. Mr. Shoot and Scoot, it's it's one versus twenty-nine, uh, including wargaming. It's it's just that's not working anymore, buddy. And you're spotted, but you scooted. You, the scooting saved you. Mr. Shoot and Scoot was saved, and now he, you're probably still detected, but he wants to take this guy out who's forgotten you're here. Oh, okay. Five ten. They're all moving towards you now. What does he do? What does he do? What is he, do? he scoots? No, he doesn't scoot. He creates another angle. He crafts another angle, guys. He crafts another angle, and he boom. He takes one out, and he does not reverse. He goes forward because it's faster than reversing. See, that was very important too. Did you notice that? Oh, he got shot by that T28. He he went forward instead of reverse, and he just boom. He takes one. He goes forward. He doesn't reverse. He uses his momentum. He takes 77 damage. He goes, uses the... Oh, he took another... They're hitting him easily because they have the winning team RNG. Even though he's the smallest tank in the game. And he's... Well, almost the smallest tank in the game. And he's going full speed. They can easily hit him. And that guy missed, though. And he gets scooted and shooted. And now he's going to scoot. No, I got the, the orders mixed up. He didn't get scooted. He got shooted. Now he's scooted. Shoot and scoot. And can he... There's a dead tree. Uh, not a dead tree. Tree knocked down. Just shoot the house. Take two shots. Shoot the house. Boom. Oh, there you go. Okay. Now use that little bush. There he goes. It's KV one time. He's got APCR loaded now. He's not interested in that guy? What are you doing? Why don't you shoot him? What's going on? He's scooting. He's forgotten shooting. He could have been shooting, but he started scooting. I think he got confused. Or maybe he's decided he's going to take out the M. There, he's decided to take out the M. What are you doing? You were shooting perfectly and now you're scooting. 
Oh, there's Ayu. I got. I, does it make sense to you? He was doing it perfectly the whole game. He was shooting and scooting, and all of a sudden he started scooting before he was shooting. Okay. He's gonna go. Now there's two in the cap. You gotta get in there and you gotta start shooting. He's gotta get some. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. The whole point. You got 20 seconds left. Can he? This guy thinks by moving around he's gonna be safe, but no, you got the. Oh, there's the KV1. The, oh, the invisible KV1, guys. The KV1 was invisible. The KV1 has amazing concealment. Especially when you're winning. When you're playing a KV1 and you're winning, your concealment is just. Just so. It's so good. Um, <clears throat> that's, that's what Wargaming decided. Now he's scooting it. Why is he scooting? Because the T14 is coming towards him. You've got to reset, though. You have no choice. You've got to reset. You've got to make this shot count. Aim, 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 aim. Boom. Reset. Okay, now you can scoot. Scoot! He didn't get spotted because he put some distance between him and the KV-1. The KV-1 does not have good view range. The KV-1 does not use his W key because he's, you know, a Muppet that just started playing this game. And he's dead. He's exploded. Mommy, the KV-1 has just exploded. Don't act so surprised because KV-1s explode every day. Oh, there's the T-14. The T-14 does not detect him. No, the T-14 is... And the artillery is still shooting. He's scooting now. Is he going to go kill the artillery? There's also... An, there's two of them. There's two of those... Click, those filthy, disgusting, filthy clickers. But he knows where to go. He's going to find a bush. And he's going to try and spot the T-14. And make a mockery of him. There's the bush. He spotted him. And now it's time to make a mockery of him. Make a mockery of him. Makes a mockery. Subila penetre. And now scoot! The artillery's aiming. The artillery's missing. He scooted. You're still spotted. How does it how come he's only lit for like he pops back up before 10 seconds and he's he's not spotted and what do you have? Some sort of cloak of, of invisibility? Because you did not um, you did not wait 10 seconds until you pop back up there. And that's, that is just weird. But he's making another angle. The T-14 is making himself a target again. Make a mockery of him. Make a mockery of him. Mockery. Wargaming made a mockery of you. You've been mockeried. And this guy's looking around going, Daddy. Daddy, I don't usually play uh, tier 5. I usually play tier 2. I'm not really sure. Daddy, what's going on? That, Daddy, I lost some HP. Am I going to lose all my HP, Daddy? I can't see the little tank. Where is he, Daddy? <laughs> I don't like this tank. <clears throat> well, that's, um, that's one way of doing it. <laughs> Here he goes. Moving forward. How? How does he get it done? He's making a mockery of this game and a mockery of my commentary. Scooting forward, shooting and scooting. Unbelievable. The AMX ELC BIS, driven by Religion of Rage. Leave some comments in the comment section, guys. I want to hear it from you. Was this one of the best games you've seen in a while? Does he deserve this epic result? He's going to shoot. And scoot. <laughs> and if you enjoyed the video and you had fun, Please subscribe to the channel. Help the channel grow. We're on a drive for 90,000, guys. We made it to 80. We had the drive for 85. And we made it. And now we're on the drive for 90, which is going to probably take years. <laughs> Shoot! And scoot! Why'd you load HE? What's wrong with you? You've been doing it perfectly without HE. But now he's happy. He's got his pee, -pee erect. He knows that he can outmaneuver this guy. And he's just going to pump him one for victoire. Well played, well played, well played. And that's how you get Kolobanov's, Pascucci's, Pools, High Caliber, Tank Sniper, Defender, and Top Gun. 4,592 damage, 11 kills in a Tier 5 game, and you make credits. That's how it's done. That's how it's done. Thanks for watching, guys. Leave some comments in the comments section. Have a fantastic rest of your day and I will catch you
on the next one.